why does the tiny northern country of the Netherlands have 800 times the solar capacity installed in Saskatchewan does currently? They have 70% of our solar power. That's 70% of our sun. It's cloudy there. It's more north than us. 800 times what we do. And yet, Sask Power says we can't do solar. The Crown Oil Utility, they sent me a, a kit on the future of renewables and says Saskatchewan might get to a paltry 8 or 9% solar generation by 2050. Saskatchewan! By 2050, when solar panels are cheaper than cornflakes. By 2050, 15 years after each solar panel may be able to produce twice as much energy as it did just a few years ago. By 2050, almost 30 years after, solar was declared the cheapest energy on the planet. 30 years after that! We know Saskatchewan has the best solar resources in Canada. Saskatchewan's a very sunny place. Saskatchewan's 15 times bigger. 652,000 square kilometers for us, 42,000 for them. And not only is the Netherlands small, that's chock full of Netherlanders. They squeeze 17.6 million people in there, so you might think it's not a lot of room for solar. A solar panel in Saskatchewan will produce 142% the electricity over time as the same solar panel in the Netherlands. Yet Sask Power says solar doesn't work here. They're lying. It's clear. Okay, I've decided they're lying. They're evil. The Netherlands is adding four to five gigawatts of solar per year. SAS Power is finally adding 0.2 gigawatts. The Netherlands, already light years ahead of Saskatchewan, is producing 25 times the solar that we're currently installing. For every panel we put up, they put up 25. In the first half of 2023, solar power covered 19% of their power demand. That's a quarter of a century and then some before SAS Power's lofty 9% goal. Why does a place with a 15th of land, two-thirds of sunshine, already have 800 times the solar power we do? What's going on, SAS Power? Just come clean. You're evil. Quit your jobs. Go somewhere else. Work for the oil industry. Get somebody who's in touch with the world.